can we create super plants? And in this video, we will go even a step further. Can we create magic drinks? I invite you to another test in Matthias' lab. And in today's video, we will elaborate on electroculture, electroculture farming and the famous Lakovsky coil. Why not address this controversial topic? This makes our lab even more interesting. And is it sci-fi or is it just unexplored border area? Let's dive into this topic. Probably you already heard of electroculture farming and the famous Lakovsky coil. If not even better, then you listen to it now. And here you can see a typical Lakovsky coil. Lakovsky seems Russian and you are right. George Lakovsky. He lived from 1869 until 1942. He was a Russian French engineer, an author and an inventor. Lakovsky's invention was the multiple wave oscillator. The oscillator's main circuit basically consists of concentric rings forming electrical dipole antennas having capacitive gaps opposing each other by 180 degrees. Lakovsky's circuit was fed with high voltage and high frequency impulses from a generator, usually a spark cap Tesla coil or an Udin coil. If set up correctly, the unit is supposed to create a broad band of frequency spectrum of low amplitude covering a much greater range of frequencies from 1 Hz to 300 gigahertz than those of the exciting generator, usually several 100 kilohertz to a few megahertz from a Tesla transformer or several kilohertz from an induction coil. The power of each individual frequency in this broadband noise spectrum is very low. In order to create more harmonics and subharmonics, an additional spark gap on the secondary side has been found in some devices being mounted directly on the antenna or being mounted in parallel to the secondary coil. What means? As it is built as a coil, it is nearly a magnetic loop antenna for a very high frequency spectrum. By the way, these magnetic loop antennas were even used by the military for communication and are even more widespread among amateur radio operators until today. Most of them are home built, but they are also sold by various companies. And the interesting thing is, as it is a resonant circuit, it can receive and transmit at the same time. We don't have to feed it with pulses or other frequencies. And this is what we see in electroculture farming. There's a coil wound around a tree, around a bush, around the vegetable in the garden and people hope to increase the growth of their plants. And indeed a Lakovsky coil is a complete magnetic loop antenna. We have the coil and then at the end we have a capacitor and this creates a resonant frequency. And I would swear most people that build their coils are not aware that there's a certain resonant frequency that matches exactly the length of the antenna, the diameter and the capacitance. And as a magnetic loop antenna has a very narrow bandwidth, there are not a lot of overtones. It has a really clean resonance frequency, but there are always overtones. We can say it is fed by all the magnetic waves that are all around, they are resonating in the circuit and are radiated back. In this case, back to the flower or the plant or the tree or the bush. And as you see, my cyclamen likes it. It grows like crazy. But as I said, we go even a little further. These coils are working with plants and plants are mostly made out of water. And therefore I thought we can use the system also for liquids. A good cup of coffee with a copper coil, a Lakowski coil, the rounding, this is the capacitor and we have a resonant circuit. And I drink my coffee from this cup and we can go even further. When we drink some water, or you can put your favorite beer in it, a juice or a wine, you see, this is the coil. 
can you see it good? Yes, here. This is this is the coil. This is the capacitor. Do I change? I don't know. I test it out. As I said, we are in the lab. We are testing this out. We can test this with plants. I test this with coffee and juice and water. And for now I can say, I feel good. Nothing strange happens in my life until now. And you might think dealing with food and drinks, could it be dangerous? I don't know. Therefore, I test it out. Is it sci-fi or is it just unexplored border area? I think it is the second one. Or do you say, mm, this is just a placebo, like when you get a placebo from the doctor, it's just a sugar pill. So it has no function, but I think it has a function. Is this a replacement? of a real function. Is this working or is my mind working? Hard to say, but when this works or whether the mind works, doesn't matter. At least the growth is good. And when I drink my water, my wine, my beer or my coffee and Just like a placebo, I think this works. And then I'm focusing all my willpower, all my creative intent. The coffee tastes better. Is it because of this or is it because of this? We don't know, but at least we are doing something and we create a different effect. And only this counts. So when you are familiar with all these topics, write your experiences, your opinions in the comments. I like to learn new things and I like to be in contact with my viewers. And I keep doing my stuff and I'll keep you updated. Let's see what happens. Thank you very much for listening and this much more good stuff on my channel. Explore.